Hello guys and welcome back to our channel, Amy and Tay. In today's video, we are reacting to 10 of the world's most ugly animals. Amy isn't in the video. I was going to say your mum isn't in the video. Wow. How can she do something? Okay. <laughs> You're going to make a joke about that, mum. What's in? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Top 10 Archive. They say that true beauty is on the inside, which means that there must be a whole world of kindness in the animal kingdom. What is that animal though on the screen right now? A fish. Is that a real animal? Because it looks like a face with something else. Like it I is know. a real animal because, <laughs> wow, I've seen it before, but yes, it's a fish. It does guys. look like something what I've seen before downright ugliest creatures to ever walk the earth. Top 10 ugliest animals. Oh. Number 10, Sphinx cat. Oh, come on, cats are Let's supposed stop. to be- I've got to say, these are ugly. Yes, they are. No, I, I honestly do not think these are ugly. Honestly. They look like Big like, Vini. Why do they? Because look at them all wrinkly. Yeah, wrinkly, not veiny. They're ah. disgusting. If I had to have a cat, I would get one of these. Why do you just get a normal cat? Because these don't even like leave hairs everywhere. I knew you were going to say that. So but they like, just look so That's ugly. a bonus. And like, these look unique. Every other furry cat just looks the same. Why do you want the boring cat which leaves hairballs all over the ass? Do you know what I mean? Okay. Yeah, it is a nice pussy after this one. <laughs> <laughs> hearts until they melt into a puddle on the floor. But that can't be said about all breeds of feline. Looking at the Sphinx cat specifically, oh, wow. there yeah. is such a thing as oh, an... Oh, oh my days, man. <laughs> 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 Biggest change is mine. Pretend it doesn't have a head. It looks like a chicken. Like, oh, yeah, it does ready actually. to cook. Ready for Christmas dinner, turkey or something. What makes the Sphinx cat so different from its fuzzy counterparts is the complete lack of fur, which really makes it look like the skin of a wrinkly old man. Even as a kitten, the Sphinx cat looks a little off. Oh, man. I would never get that cat. Number nine, monkfish. The monkfish, or Lophius, is found around the coast of Europe and the Cape just a quick one, guys. That isn't my dad holding a fish. Nobody thought that was your dad. How do you know? It does look similar to your dad, to be fair. No, because this creature is not something you want to look at on a daily basis. From afar, this black mass of slimy skin looks like an isolated oil spill until it opens its mouth to reveal a threatening looking set of teeth. The proboscis monkey can be found on the Southeast Asian island of Borneo and should probably be in the dictionary next to the word ugly. This odd-looking primate is one of the largest species within Asia and is best known as Not too many lines. The this one goes on its already unattractive face. It's actually quite cute. <laughs> monkeys, oh, look at its eyebrows. Oh, look at its eyebrows. centimeters <laughs> or roughly 3.9 feet. <laughs> Looks like something which I know, right? <laughs> to know. I think that's a bit dodgy, mate. That looks like your brother's little ting. Doesn't it? Willie. Ew. It's a bit dodgy, mate. Philippine Tarsier. Oh, I don't like that. The Philippine Tarsier, or the Mag, may only grow to be about 16 centimeters or 6.3 <laughs> inches, but it's, it's actually like the creature's small size that attributes to its general hideous nature. The two large globes that are this tiny imp's eyes seem like they could stare into your soul and find out all of your nasty little secrets. If I seen that, I don't know what I'd do. Would you run away? Yeah, 100%. Would you? No, it's What not. if it looked you in the eye? It's like you're centimetre tall. Ooh, you're hard, showing off. Number five, aye aye. In the words of the great Ricky Ricardo, aye aye aye. A horrible pun, we know, but there is really no other way to describe this Madagascar-based lemur. 
More than any primate, this tiny nocturnal creature looks more akin to a common bat with slender, clawed fingers, <gasps> beady yellow eyes, and rounded ears atop its slightly elongated snout. Your cross yeah. one late at night would probably oh. elicit the same reaction. Oh In the right lighting, the eye eye may look. <gasps> Looks like it's got pubes stuck on it. <laughs> it? Got a receding hairline. Is it? Yeah. Need some hair growth on that. Number four, naked mole rat. Oh, that it's looks a like you. <laughs> How does it? Look at it. Look at the teeth. A lack of fur is not generally an attractive <laughs> look for animals that, well, normally have it. In the case of the naked oh. mole rat, it is a completely unfortunate sight. It looks like it's been in a fire. <laughs> it does. Come out. I was gonna say it looks like it's been cooked. I think. A Chinese man's grabbed it and thought, shall I cook it? And then thought, oh no, leave it. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Where are its eyes though? That's a good question. So it has very small eyes, almost non existent looking. And it's it not a corp. Number three, <gasps> sea pig. Oh, it's called a sea pig. I love these. So it must be a. How's that on the ugliest animals? And how's it number three? Well, that should be like the least ugliest if it's on there. I but love sea pigs. I actually like pigs, me. Um, Especially sea pigs. And I want to go to where is it, like Maldives, wherever it is. I mean, I think we do like a... Bahamas. Oh, yeah. I think we do a pig beach. So if you just subscribe to the channel and get us to the point when we get some cash over. So you can take me. Which is Australian for money. We can go and vlog it for you. <laughs> but nah, on a real note, I do want to go there. I do. He'd be so scared of the pigs, can I just add? Why? I like pigs, mate. You don't want to wait for them, though. You do, like, you do that thing like you always do, at rate brave, like it was in the birdcage in Tenerife. Yes. What is it? On your shoulder. <laughs> it's okay. It's just stuck. <laughs> and then as soon as one comes close to him, he'd be running away. He'd be like, oh, Amy, 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 I can promise you, yeah. I've stroked pigs many times. Do you not know how very absolutely wrong? Cute. This flabby underwater monstrosity is the absolute opposite of cute and cuddly. It's downright oh. terrifying to look at. Oh. Clearly, the product of Mother Nature playing way too much Half Life. The near transparent exterior of this bottom dweller is that a sea pig? No, it is. See? Yeah. I thought, I thought he meant a pig swimming in the sea, not one of them so, things. What, but the sea pig, it's showing a picture of that pig? Yeah, because that's what we expected, he said that's a cute oh, one. Oh, right. So what's this? Is this the this same thing a sea pig. as a baby? No! <laughs> it's a sea pig, like a little oh, bug. Right. You wanted to go Bahamas to see that. Number two, star-nosed mole. Go ahead, take a good close look at the star-nosed mole. The odd-shaped nose at the end of its snout looks like a parasitic oh, creature attached itself to the poor mole's face, a look amplified by the fact that the organ is constantly moving. In actuality, the nose does serve a very practical purpose. The star-shaped nose is covered in minuscule touch receptors that help the animal find prey in extremely low-light situations. Unfortunately, oh. practicality Clever. doesn't make it any less ugly. Sorry, David Attenborough. Number one, blobfish. The oh, fish receives it from was its called gelatinous blobfish. flesh, which has a density slightly less than water, a trait which what allows it to float above the seafloor without having to utilize much energy. The blobfish... Girls when they get too much lip filler. <laughs> that does look like girls when they have lip filler, doesn't it? I just said that and I steal in my joke. <laughs> he always does this. What? Steal my jokes. People say we're funny. No, it's me that's funny. You repeat my joke. Make it sound yeah. like you're funny. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you comment down below any videos you'd like us to react to. Hopefully. Oh, I didn't be. Taylor's not cut out for reaction videos. That's why we need your suggestions, guys, down yes. below. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, Please smash that like button, comment, and, and subscribe. subscribe. 
and turn on the notifications bell so you're notified every time I upload a video.